This is the way of the samurai. Three. Is he in search of samurai glory or coffee and Advil? Nice music. Let's start a game here by creating your character and naming him. I'll name my guy Shinobi. Aha, it's a play on words. This is a pretty heavy game. Heavy is a word that has not been used enough as like a cool adjective since Back to the Future, so I'm bringing it back. Doc, this is a heavy Japanese style adventure game. You're not going to just dive into this and figure it out right away and win it in a few hours. Way of the Samurai 3 will take some time, it will take some patience. It will take some understanding. It's a relationship between you and your video game. In any relationship, there's some give and take. It will give you a cool, relatively open world samurai adventure, but it will take a lot of your patience by way of some clumsy controls, an awkward saving system, and some kludgy issues here and there. It's not a well-polished mainstream game, but there's definitely something to it that's cool. Most of what we're looking at here is very early on in the game. You can spend a lot of time in here. There's an overall storyline, which you'll see starting up here, but you go on a number of jobs and there's a lot of side things that you can do as well. The game doesn't seem to like it if you just run around and try to slaughter everyone, though. It, it um, you sort of get penalized for that. I guess that's not the way of the samurai. That's the way of classic game room. Oh, no, no, he got rewarded there. Shinobi got uh, some achievement points. I wonder if he can spend those on sake. And what about you? You don't seem like the type to fight without purpose. Lady, you don't watch this show, do you? I still don't trust you. What's not to trust? Seriously. <laughs> hey, car keys! I can't believe they charged me a villain penalty. With just 68 acts of villainry, that's like Good Samaritan work. I actually thought I had more than that. I guess kicking people is not a true act of villainry. You can have a lot of fun in this game, just make sure you save your game beforehand. It took me a while to figure it out. You have to talk to the people with guitars and not attack them. You have to talk to them or something. It did take me a while to get into Way of the Samurai 3, just to figure out the general mechanics of the gameplay. Even though I play a lot of Japanese games, I just couldn't quite figure out what this one wanted me to do at times. I, have, I had to go out on a mission and punish somebody for speaking badly about my clan, but I couldn't kill them. Which just completely stumped me, so I started uh, attacking them in various ways with the back of my sword. It must have taken me two hours to just figure out if I beat the crap out of them using my fists that I then scared him without actually killing him and completed the mission. And I took this other mission where I had to go out and apologize for something. And uh, I, you know, I don't speak Japanese. I guess that's some fancy Japanese word for kill everybody in the village. But when I was apologizing, I'd always uh, lose the mission. As you play through the game, you master different weapons and fighting techniques. You have a quick attack and a special attack. It takes a little while to get used to. It's not quite as fluid or intuitive as many other action games. 
But if you're looking for a good open world, go out and cause mayhem and just work your way through a mission, choosing your own adventure, Way of the Samurai 3 might be worth your time. The dialogue is actually quite entertaining. I have no idea what the original dialogue was, or if they even rewrote it, but it was, it's pretty funny at times. I appreciate a good laugh right before I destroy an entire village. The way that I'm playing it during the review makes it look more like a Grand Theft Auto than a serious samurai adventure game, but to actually play this game correctly, you really have to play the way of the samurai. If you're looking for a substantial, heavy, samurai kind of game, one that will take you a while to play, this is one to check out if you just want to blow the crap out of things with a game that you can just dive right into and play, this is not the game you want. In any event, if you do start playing this, or if you rent it or pick it up, give it some time to really get into the game. It's like a Tootsie Pop filled with meat. That's a really weird analogy, but I think you know what I'm saying. <laughs>